Alright, how's it going guys? Welcome back for some more K2. And I want to get the rare metal done today. Because we need that for upgrading our electric miner drill to Mark II. We also need steel gears, but we already have that taken care of. So... Uh, rare metal should be in here. There it is. Which is raw, rare metal. And it looks like it's just smelted normally. So we just need to go and mine it. So let's get that done. Um, our research got done on our mining productivity. So now we have a choice to make here. Uh, we have advanced chemistry, which is chlorine and hydrogen, nitric acid, ammonia, water separation for oxygen, hydrogen, um, and bioethanol with oxygen and steam, <coughs> which can make us, uh, which can be made in the fuel refinery. That looks rather chemistry and interesting we have advanced labs that we can do um, which is more efficient incompatible with basic tech cards i don't know how we would do oh we don't need basic tech cards anymore well that's something i didn't realize Okay, so we don't need those anymore. We can get rid of that. Um, we have uranium processing, so we can start a reactor. We have low-density structures. Our lab speed. And that's about it. Um, oh, we also have advanced electronics too, which will give us our blue ones. And our rocket fuel. And so I think... We're going to start here with the advanced chem so we can get into some of that. By the way, speaking of the basic tech cards, we had our old area here where our tech cards were being made. I went ahead and cleared that out so we've got a little bit more room we can use here if we need it for something. Um, I also really need to fix that. That's annoying. And I also got our copper smelting area set up here. Just running it straight over here. Cleaned up that uh, fuel belt. And I also ran our iron ore. Because there is still just a little bit right there. Lined down to go into our uh, thing here. Which is now completely full. And so let's get started on this rare metal. We do have rare metal right down here next to where we're mining our iron. That'll be nice and easy to get mined up here. We won't have to bring that in. And uh-oh. We need a fluid for this one. Uh, we may not be able to do this today. I'm going to have to figure out what fluid it is that we actually need here. Go ahead and lay these out a bit here. <coughs> um, by the way, while I'm getting this done here doing the vanilla playthrough stream to get some of the achievements that I've never gotten done and got three of them done today <clears throat> I now have the uh, golem I finally got hit by a train and survived it also finished the game 
with no solar this one i got that one done and what was the other one we did today we did another one today and i don't remember what it was we also managed to get the uh rocket launched and i sent up fish because well you have to send up fish it's just something you have to do um but yeah we got our first rocket out it was cool and basically just working on getting all the technology done now so we can get that achievement done and spent the whole day just upgrading stuff for circuits okay so let's see what this says here uh, production consumes chlorine. Now, don't we have chlorine right up here? From, yeah, right here. We've got a whole tank of this shit. Awesome. Alright, so we do not have to worry about that. We have all kinds of that. So, let's get... This all set up here. Um, I'm just going to use undergrounds. I don't know why I thought that was going to work like a belt and just <coughs> do the undergrounds for me. All right. So now... Let me see. So that's right there. And our chlorine is over there. We got a pretty decent run up there. So let's just take this up. And then we'll run this over to right here next to our steel. Which that's close enough for right now like that and that and then we can just run this right up alongside here <clears throat> I hate it when it does that I swear there was an update that changed that, that they used to jump back. I might be confused, but I swore there was. Okay, so now we gotta get through there. We do have landfills, so. Just bring this up. And we wanna go about right here. So, let's grab some landfill. We'll just make us a nice little path right across here. And we're going to go out from here. And I missed just a little. Alright, let's fix that. And there we go. We have chlorine. And then it looks like our boiler. Oh, that's the one I did. That's the other achievement I did. No, I already said I did no solar. Hell, I don't know. I know I did. I. I swear there was three I did today. I don't remember what the other one is. <coughs> Goodness, excuse me.
All right, so let's get some power down here. We have our chlorine now. And we have our iron and our steel smelting there. I think I'm just going to copy our iron smelting area here. And we're just going to smelt this right here. No real reason not to, I guess. And let's grab one of these. And we'll put it right there. <coughs> grab our pole here. And there. We'll go ahead and put a radar down. That way we can see down through there. And we're getting pretty spread out. I, I do believe that's getting attacked. Or getting hit. So probably going to come over here and hit these guys. I think it's about time to start getting some defenses around here. I know some people, um, XAR mainly, that disagrees, disagrees with me making a bunch of bullets and walls and stuff, but I rather like it. So I think I'm going to work on getting a nice perimeter made. Um, I'll basically cut across right there. And then I'll do similar right across here. And I will do one... Um, actually, I may do, there really isn't a place to do it right there, though. That kind of stinks. So we're going to have to go up and over and do a corner right there. Keep that copper inside. Because we're going to need that. <coughs> and then I'll just do a big long one down here. Uh, probably go underneath these two things of crude oil. I'm not sure exactly because there is two nice things of copper there too. So I got to figure out. But uh, I'll do that off camera unless you guys leave me a comment and let me know that you'd like to see me live stream doing it. Um, I can always do that if you're interested but I'm figuring um, probably not but it's up to you guys um, I don't know why I'm changing those I'm going to go ahead and change those two though all right, so let's get our poles out here. There we go. Get that all going and that taken care of. By the way, I cleaned up my blueprints a little bit. I do have a few I need to get cleaned out of there that I really don't need. But there we go. We now have our rare metals mining up and cooking up. Now we just need to send this up. <coughs> just jump this right on over. And we'll send this over where the iron and the steel go up. Leaving 
a little bit of room in case we need more iron or steel belts coming up. And I think I may change this over as well. Bring this um, down so it's not right up in there kind of bring it down into this area here i think and put a big smelter for that as well uh we need to see how we're putting these rare metals on the belt because um well let's use fnei here real quick And let's see. So, mark two of that. Artillery wagon. DT fuel. Uh, da -da -da -da. Advanced chem plant. Advanced furnace. Advanced radar. Advanced transport belt. Okay. Those are... I'm just trying to figure out if... Yeah, see, we have belts right here. So I'd want to put that with these. <coughs> Which means that I need to have them come across here. But we have our circuits here. That are sort of in the way. Uh, we don't have any more belts actually open here. Um... I could pop this down a little bit because it does look like we're going to have some more stuff. I could also just move this when we need to um, for our belts. Our miners are actually right there. There's the radars. Those are going to need it as well. So for right now, I'm going to bring it up and have it come in right here next to the steel and across right here and we'll there's no way of me getting it yeah there's no way of me getting it up there so i definitely would have to put it across right there and i need two gap and we have our plastic right there so I may have to move that down, but since right now the only thing we're really worried about is the miners, I'm going to go ahead and just worry about getting it over to that area and then we'll figure out what we're going to do to get past the circuit area later. <clears throat> There's a gap, I might as well use it. Alright, so I'm actually going to come across right here. And we need to go basically right here. Okay. See, that's going to be a problem. Except... Mm, yeah, that's going to be a little bit of a pain. But we can do that. And then we need to get this over. Because we need... Uh, where are my... We're going to need one of these set for that. 
We're going to need to get steel and this stuff together. We need the steel gears. And this area is all packed full of stuff. And there's not really anywhere for me to get through there. So, this across here. Don't need that. And we can do I'm trying to decide where I want to bring this up at. Probably bring it up here. <clears throat> so we're gonna need to do this. We're going to have this go up right there. So we're also going to need to do that. Bring this across. And we need to get the... That. Then that. go now we can bring this up and I'm gonna do something that's gonna look horrible <clears throat> but it's gonna work all right so that'll get that in there uh, we need four of those, five of the gears, and yeah, it'll be quick enough. We can just use those, and we're going to actually, um, yeah, I'm going to take that out, I'm going to grab those. Throw them in there, which they're now going to be taking them and putting them Lord only knows where. Because <clears throat> I forgot to take that out of there. Um, so we want to click on that. We want to change it over to that. Down like a shoe. We're going to set this for the filter of those. Set that up like that. We'll get this. Take care of that. Set this. Ooh, did you see that? There's a Mark III, apparently. And there's a quarry drill. Damn. I like it. All right, so we'll set this to 100. And actually, I'm going to take that out. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to set this for these miners. So it can input into there. And I'm actually going to use the fast one, because that should hopefully get them in there before this does. And I'm actually going to use this to make sure. So we'll set this. That if there's any of these in the box. It can only enable if this is empty. So now I have to figure out where they put the other ones. Because I have no clue. 
Okay, advanced chemistry is done. We can now do biofuel. Uh, we have ore enrichment, which is right down my alley. So enriching iron with sulfuric acid and water. It'll give us dirty water and enriched iron. We can do that with copper and rare metal. That one's going to take hydrogen chloride. And then that is five enriched to five iron plates. And we're doing nine to get six. Interesting. Filter dirty water. Dirty water will give us stone, iron, and water. Stone, copper, and water. Or stone, rare metal, and water. Interesting. All right. Uh, what is this? Air purification. Absorb solution. Oh, that's interesting. All right. And we have lithium processing. Uh, let's go ahead. And you know what? I'm just going to start here. That looks like the end of that one. <coughs> and then we can set up some biofuel. That's getting our miners done for us. Um, get that out of there. And we can throw that in there as well. I got 16 of these already. So now I can go around and change those out. I'm not going to bother with changing any of these up here. They don't run that often. I may do some of the copper ones maybe, but that would be about it. Um, but let's go ahead and change over these. So now, can we do this? Absolutely, we can. It's going to change my belts, too, but... Oh, hell, listen to that thing roar. Those are much louder. So that'll get us more of that rare metal. We might have to go and get some more from somewhere else. Uh, do we have... This is raw immersite. That's not the same thing. That's iron. Let's turn this pollution off. There's rare metal little bitty old thing though apparently we have a little bit of copper right there that got cut off um yeah I don't see much more of that so hopefully that's how dense is that 849 that's not too much so we might have to go out exploring when we get done with that one there's 115 there that's not too great um we're also gonna have to keep an eye on the chlorine now make sure we don't run low on that but it looks like we've got a decent amount of it for what we're using right now so Nothing we really have to worry about. Let's check the power, which is good. We're not even running our boilers right now. And we're also not running those. Everything's coming from our big solar array right there. So that's cool. Chlorine is still about half a 
tank in our huge tank. So we're doing good there. We're full on hydrogen because we're not making any of that fuel right now. All right. So I really want to get to doing another crafting one. Um, I still won't need to get... Um, I don't care about the flare stacks. I will try not to have to use them. Um, I still want to get the steel pipes, the steel pumps, and the steel tanks automated at some point. But it's not something we really have pressing at the moment. Uh, we do have our modular armor done. Which we are wearing. But we do have some other things here. We have a shield generator. Uh, night vision I'm not worried about. We have a second tier portable. Hmm. Additional electric engine. We're probably going to need that. But yeah, I think next time we're going to take a look at the uh, chemical stuff that we just got done doing here and see what we're going to need for these things and probably get started making it. Or at least setting up some of it. So, and I'm going to go ahead in between videos and move this down a bit because it looks like we're going to have at least a few more uh, minerals. We're going to have that immersite, whatever that is. So I'm going to put a belt that goes across here. We'll basically have two more. We'll have that for rare and that for immersite. And then I'll probably leave room for one more belt down here. And then we'll put our uh, circuits down below that. Although, if I'm going to move those circuits, I may just move them like all the way down over here. That way we can send the iron, copper, and plastic over there to do it separate so it's not taking off of my main belt which is probably what I'll do I'll probably just move them all the way down over in this area and then we can send a separate belt over to do them because eventually we're going to be getting into modules and all that stuff and we're going to need but tons of circuits. But anyways, I think I have rambled long enough for today. Um, biofuel just got done. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this one to get it done and out of the way. And then we will start on the ore enrichment next time. So have a good one. Thanks for all the support, guys, and I will see you guys later.